Well, hello everyone, this is Rick Bray with the Plick team at Broomtown Gabosis. And knowing that some districts in our area are using Zoom as an attendance thing, and in addition to that, knowing that some districts have the, uh, the policy, if you will, that students can't come in unless their, their name is correct and it matches who they are. We've had some requests come in for how do I change my name as a participant in Zoom? So let's take a look at how to do that. And we're going to look at kind of the two big players when it comes to devices in our region. And that's iOS devices. So that could be an iPhone, an iPod Touch, an iPad, iPad mini, any iOS device. From what I can tell, uh, this process is all the same regardless of the size of the screen. The other big device is going to be Chromebooks and we'll look at two different ways. Again, setting our name before joining the meeting so that we can make sure that our display name is accurate with our actual name. So with that, let's start off with iOS devices. When I'm in my iOS device, first thing I want to do is open up the Zoom app or I can click the link, which will open it up. I click on the join a meeting and uh, there's the space where I can change my screen name. I can either delete it, exit out, and then just write my first name so as to maintain that student data privacy that we want. Great, so that's iOS devices. Let's take a look at Chromebooks. Now in Chromebooks, I click the link and there's two different ways to do it. I'll start off with kind of the, the real basic version, which at the bottom of the screen is to join with a web browser. We talked about this in another video, but you'll see right here, I can put my first name in as my display name. I'm gonna need to go through a captcha process where I show that I'm not a robot. Maybe you gotta click on pictures, but with that, when that's all set, you click the join button and boom, you're in. The meeting now there is another way to do this with the zoom app on your chromebook and we talked about this in another video um, so i'll put a card up to show that one um, and we'll kind of speed this process up because you don't need to see this the same way but the idea is if you have the app instead of joining through the browser when you click on the link it's going to open the app on the chromebook like this and oh, like there we go like this and again you can put your screen name in to accurately reflect your first name and then hit the blue button to join so there you have it there are uh, i guess three different ways of changing your display name as a participant in zoom prior to joining the meeting and again we want to do this to make sure that the display name accurately matches who we actually say we are so I hope this helps. Thank you very much for watching.